folks, what is up and welcome back to another episode of Ace Attorney with an actual lawyer. I'm your host, Zach, joined by our voice actor, Wes. How high do you think Zach's voice can actually go? Oh, we're going to find out. Our guest voice actor, Chris. Hi, folks. After this, maybe give something else on Save Data a try. And our like. actual lawyer, bitch. Stop it. <laughs> <laughs> Folks, follow us on twitch.tv slash save that a team. Sometimes watch us on YouTube live because we do that as well, like right now. And if you can, please support us on patreon.com slash save that a team where you can get a bunch of bonus content, including just in case you haven't seen it yet, folks, getting your name included in this month's brand new holiday themed Patreon song. Nope, it didn't play the holiday one. Why didn't it play the holiday one? Crone Knight, Bun Nandy Cosmo, Kaday Burn Less Danny, Halucha Sofino, Shadow Wind Navi, Chrissy Sky Herlock High, Nicole Mr. Mocha, Mickey Elijah Sly, Diego Garcia, Burger Bun, Witch Tower, Safari, Arky, Kevin Asian Dessert Boy Man, Sillart Mystic Woody. Big Kerbo, Jack Warner, QB Nagashi, The Driver 458, Kacha Haruka Nayagi, Aleya Yakta Est, Charlie and Shrim R E, and Luster Daydrick, and Boomer Emily, BBC Watcher Locks, Forensic Back Rick Rat, Rijer Army Bushok, and a Magic and Snow Cat. Leprechaun, Jacob Bell, Ever Entropy, Conjuring Scribes, Ill Written Word, and Who Needs to Sleep, Shaberstein, HSM, Daedric Maho Stars, Amelia Super Cool, Fluff Go Fantasy Marbar, Croissant Mr. Cola, and Traveling in a Box, Seraphina, and JFJ All Rocks, Shade the Punisher, Confer and Fulfilla, Traveling in a Box, Mega Zero, The Jester Sibylla. Thank you all our Patreons, you are all so great. Thanks for all of the support of a happy holiday. Thank you all for the support of a happy holiday. With that all the way, let's get back into the game. Uh. All right, uh, last time we got permission to finally go into the Maractus Clinic, so let's go do that. Oh, shit. No. I knew Bill. you were going to do that. Bill. I knew it's, it's, you were. You have, because, you have to. We couldn't stop him in time. No. <laughs> <laughs> There's one thing Wes is, it's consistent. Zach's new, uh, Wes's new makes Zach go, No! <laughs> Ah, you two again. <laughs> when, when, oh, when will you learn? This How many times did you teach you this lesson, old man? I'm like 24. Wait, is he 24 or 22 at this point? I can't. Who remember. cares? <laughs> Apollo doesn't even have a way, thing. Baby. Apollo doesn't even have a thing. Yeah, you can't. You can't. He's a ghost. Well, How old's Clavier? He's probably like the same age. Yeah, I bet he's, 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 he's older. He rules. He's 24. All right, 24 it is. And if anyone posts his age in the chat, it's wrong. It's <laughs> you say that right as people are furiously and in, and in, and in, he's 22. And in fact, you're going to be banned for it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry for you to find out this way. Paper and wings, stargazing, bang, fire guns, and asterisk. Bang, and bang. <laughs> <laughs> so good. Look at me however you want. You're not getting in today. I wouldn't be so sure if I were you. Look what we have. What's this? Detective Sky? No, this isn't Detective Sky, it's a letter. <laughs> it's a piece of paper. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry, oh. I, forgot, I forgot my glasses at home. <laughs> Yesterday it was Prosecutor Gavin, today it's Detective Sky. Tomorrow will be the judge. Who are you two? Really? Who are these guys? Who are these guys? Now he's suspicious again. 
Well, you got the orders. I gotta let you in. Have fun! <laughs> Thanks, Mr. Officer. Let's hit it, Apollo. I don't know why this hit me. Ow! Why did you hit me? This this <laughs> occurred to me like five minutes after uh, Pridge already made the joke that this letter isn't uh, Emma. It's a letter. What if Emma did a Flat Stanley situation? Y'all remember Flat Stanley where they mailed I him? do. <laughs> wasn't, that a, wasn't that a book? It was a book, like yeah, a, yeah. Yeah. Why did Flat that Stanley was, that become was at, like, flat? Book fairs, right? Yeah. I don't fucking remember. Somebody, somebody give me the, the Flat Stanley deep lore. He was crushed by the Stanley weight of his lore. depression, like most of us. Jesus Christ. <laughs> okay. Oh, wow. You way, know what? He doesn't the weight of his sins, but. Yeah, well, I'll you know Hey, Zach, I looked up Flat Stanley, uh -huh. and the first question on people also <laughs> asked, why is how flat does Stanley, Stanley flat? become flat? <laughs> no. So, funny enough, there's another book called Stanley, Flat Again. <laughs> We can't keep this letting him get away with this. Being, this guy just won't stop being flat. Stanley. <laughs> Stanley. Oops, all flat Stanley. He's like, and, <laughs> and, the, and the reason is Stanley is hit with a rubber ball while simultaneously hitting his shoulder on a shelf, causing him to return to his flat <laughs> state from which his brother is unable to restore him to normal. What? Hey, hey author of that book that's nothing <laughs> it's like it's like at least let flat stanley go to like the the steamroller museum and oh no there's been a tragic accident that's nothing oh the in the steamroller museum like the guy at austin powers yeah. <laughs> yeah in the original flat stanley in from 1964 it's that old? Flat Stanley is squashed flat by a falling bulletin board. Okay, like that works, sure. Anyways, we spent too long on this bit. <laughs> let's go. Oh, with flat Stanley. <laughs> let's go. Let's finally see this fucking place. Oh, look at all the shoes. Oh, there's one missing. Oh, there's, oh, that's there's so no, many bowls of ramen. There's no fucking way. That the stupid idiot person took their high heels off two days ago, put on the Maractus Clinic slip-ons, did the murder, and forgot to pick their shoes back up, right? Surely! <laughs> those aren't high heels, those are wedges. You're right. Fair. Uh, oh, damn. Damn. Perjury completely throw out his theory. <laughs> damn. High heels. Fridge, fridge the fashion is, detective. The credibility has been shattered. <laughs> damn. Damn. You just got lawyered, bitch. Hey, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I hope this isn't. This might be true. Maria Mountain Cheer five dollars saying there's also invisible Stanley, which is caused by eating fruit during a thunderstorm. What, what? the literal fuck? Hold on. That does have a tendency to turn me invisible. Unless, right? unless it's a fucking devil fruit, that makes zero sense. He was in, he was in that wrestling match I showed you and Wes, Invisible Man vs. Invisible Stan. Okay, that's actually incredible. Those are really good. Alright, <clears throat> moving on. Huh. Kind of an at-home sort of place, isn't it? This place is a connection to the, this place is a connection to the murder in the park. I'm sure of it. The police oh. The police guy out front wasn't so sure. Beyond it being where the victim lived or beyond it being where the victim lived, looks like the police team's gone home for the day. There might be some clues lying, lying around. Let's get cracking, Apollo. Well, there's whenever a... that music kicks in, it's always yeah. like yeah, yeah. Oh. <laughs> it's like oh, the peyote's in. All right, let's <laughs> let's look let's look at the the ridiculous amount of bowls. Look at all these bowls. You might even say there's a ridiculous amount of them. <laughs> look at all those chickens. Look at these bowls. They're from El Dune's noodles. There's Mr. Salty. Mr. Salty. Then. I think we figured something out. I think we have. I think we have. <laughs> God damn it. Mr. Aldoon must do takeout. Oh, look at I found him on Grubhub. 
<laughs> like when oh, he hell took yeah. out, like when he took out Palmeractus. You forgot the name of the murder oh. the victim for a second, didn't you, Prince? I'm like, I, 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 I think, I, I think I just wanted to say malpractice. Yeah, I wanted to say wait, Paul. No. <laughs> wait, no, I'm, I'm right, but not exactly right. What is it actually? <laughs> Not exactly what I was thinking. All of these bowls have been washed clean. I think we found our first clue, Trucy. This Wait, is our first clue. So, We're way behind so, on shit. So Eldun sells you the ramen and the bowl. No wonder he's broke! <laughs> <laughs> the overhead costs are terrible. Let's look at these heels. Wedges, excuse me. Apparently, apparently they're just sandals. At Trucy, you're going to jail. You're going to fashion jail. <laughs> Today on Ace Attorney, we learn no one knows what shoes are. <laughs> quite a yeah, I, hey, listen. On. Listen, you never see them below the waist, so no one's wearing shoes <laughs> in the Ace Attorney world. They, they don't exist below the waist. It's, it's Jason's <laughs> worst nightmare here. <laughs> There's a single pair of sandals here. Wait, but why would there be sandals here? Unless they belong to one of the patients. Or maybe it's a visitor that's come to see Dr. Maractus. Yeah, like a patient would do. You'd think they'd use his house entrance instead of the clinic entrance in that case. And if this patient or visitor isn't still here... Why'd they leave without their shoes? Better take a closer look at these, just in case. Ah, but too bad. We already have one pair of sandals in our inventory. <laughs> Looks like we'll have to trade. It would be literally impossible for us to have two. Oh, oh we, we got can, a footprint. Get Emma. Oh, print. Emma. <laughs> I hate that. Yeah, what are you so. talking about? Wait, wait, say that one more time. We can get some toe prints. I don't think so. <gasps> Blasphemy! <laughs> he stole my bit! <laughs> hey, Apollo. You think this is... Huh. This could be a toe print. Maybe we can get a print off of this. Let's try it out. You remember how to do this? Oh god, so I do just, not remember what button I made. <laughs> All so right, just, get ready. Your, uh, get ready. Your Gregorian chanting. Yeah. yeah. Oh, oh I look at that for Yodel. <laughs> oh, my favorite Star Wars character. <laughs> hey, it worked. That looks like a big toe, maybe. What the fuck do you think it is, Apollo? Oh, it's in a shoe. It's not gonna be a fucking hand, you weirdo. <laughs> This person was walking on their hands. But wait, I mean, it's great that we got the print. But nobody, the the police office doesn't take, the police don't take your toe prints. But is there such a thing as a list of toe Let's prints? See, there we only go. Only for known, only for known foot criminals. Oh, good point. Uh, if there is, Detective Sky didn't give it to us, which means we can't match this print. This seems like a good time to ask a detective's advice. Yeah. So knew. hopefully we can find a detective. Yeah. <laughs> if only we knew yeah. one. Uh, I mean, I assume we have to realize that there's a missing shoe. Yeah, probably. These must be the slippers for patients at the clinic. The same as the pair we found, of course. Look. A single pair is missing from the rack here, too. And ours have print paint on the bottom. <coughs> Which means they were taken out of here on the night of the murder. Right. The paint's from the hit and run, after all. But what were a pair of clinic slippers doing in that trash can? And what were they doing at the scene of the hit and run? Magazine. The clinic reception desk. No one's here, of course. There's a small sign on the counter. Please pay your bill. Remember, we're the ones holding the scalpel. Brutal, but effective. 
Oh, we'll cut a bitch. <laughs> Did you look at the fish? There's actually nothing for it. Ah, oh, fuck. Which is pretty fucked up, if you ask me. Oh. Those fish could be witnesses. Okay, I was kind of hoping there'd be something separate for the bear. Trash can's not even a thing. That sucks. Look, the door says doctor's office. Think this is the victim's private office? It's not no. locked. Too bad. Why? It's not locked. That should be a good thing. Why too bad? <laughs> I, I like opening locks. It's kind of a hobby of mine. All right, that was good. That's a good yeah. reason for her to be disappointed. Yeah. <laughs> Two, I felt like it was going to be that. One, that's funny. B, something something lock picking lawyer. I appreciate you for saying one and then B. Thank yep. you. Classic. Like those little bike locks? Don't even bother putting them on when I'm around. I have stolen just a ridiculous number of bikes. <laughs> that's probably not a hobby you want to tell too many people about. Boom. Oh. Apollo, uh -oh. that sound, it came from behind this door. I genuinely, when I clicked on this door, I did not think it was important for the game. <laughs> Someone's in there. Let's check it out, Trucy. Whoa. A, a break-in. They left through the window. Wait, Apollo, you're too late to catch them now. Well, I, I could try. Because you're, because you're so slow and out of shape. Wow, this And line. dumb. That must be your experience as a panty snatcher chaser talking. Panty snatcher chaser. That is a sentence, Apollo. We should tell the police. Let's check the room out first, Apollo. If we call the police now, we'll lose our chance. You're right. She's better at this than I am. She's better at a lot of things than you are, Apollo. Yeah. <laughs> Got him. Well, one thing's for certain. This clinic and our murder case are looking pretty related now. <laughs> Trucy, they did the whole time. We just weren't allowed in here prior, despite the fact that we obviously needed to be. Mm -hmm. Okay, well, there's about a billion things to look at, so we'll just get started. Yeah, look, yeah so crawl on the ground, look for dirty toe prints. <laughs> Books and papers are scattered throughout the room. <laughs> Whoa, what a mess. This is worse than Daddy's room. The burglar must have left in a hurry. Maybe the burglar was my daddy. <laughs> Shit, we got me again, Phoenix, right? <laughs> Even the cup on the desk here is lying on its side. Huh? The juice that spilled out of that cup, it, it, it's dry. Oh my god, is it grape juice? Yeah, well, it definitely is Phoenix, right? So, the messy one wasn't our burglar just now. Someone knocked this cup over a while ago and left it. I mean, nobody came here for a couple of days and somebody, you know, fucking died, so... That's <laughs> something. This potted plant has seen better days. Hmm, that doesn't make sense either. What doesn't? Normally, burglars are looking for valuables, right? That's true. That's what I would do. Y y you know, if, if I was... Theoretically, <laughs> if I was a burglar. Yeah, if I, if I, O.J. Simpson, were going to kill my wife, let me write a book about how I would have done it. I didn't do it, though. <laughs> and then title that, If I Did It. Yeah. So why look under a potted plant? Maybe they were looking for the key to the safe. I've heard of people putting their house keys under plants, but the key to a safe? Then maybe the burglar was looking for the house key. Yeah, that's why they broke in the window to find the house key to come back in. <laughs> maybe they're looking for How a house. supposed to get in? <laughs> maybe they had the key or looking for the house underneath the plant. Oh. Oh. This is getting nowhere Big fast. Brain. Hey, uh, I'm gonna send to the PO box a copy of If I Did It, a very a pair of very small gloves and a knife, and just see what Zach does. Oh my God, I would <laughs> freak the fuck out. Also, can you mail knives? Um, 
<laughs> mail you mail <laughs> I bet you could mail a plastic knife. I bet, I bet there are certain knives you can mail. I'm not going to send you like a machete. Yeah, Chris, why don't you Google right now if you can mail <laughs> knives just to see just see what he, how many lists you get put on. Okay, Google, can I mail knives? Oh, it's answering me in the kitchen. <laughs> <laughs> Vic I love like, the idea that Vic's in there. Yeah. What are you doing? <laughs> Vic's just Vic's just in the kitchen, and all of a sudden, you can mail knives. Ah. I'm still fucking talking. <laughs> what a cute little safe. Hmm. Looks like a four-digit lock. Oh. <gasps> Gasp. Someone's already entered in two numbers, Apollo. Well, there's only 99 more left that we can try. Oh, uh, we can't write boob? Fuck this. <laughs> Just in case, delete those first two and type 8008. <laughs> <laughs> then it will look like boob, Phoenix. It'll be very poly, whoever the fuck you are. <laughs> and then turn it upside down, and it still says boob. It still, Thank it still you. says boob, Polly. Thank you, Tracy. God damn it! It's incredible. Yeah, I was waiting. I was waiting to see how long it took someone to suggest we type Leon. Thank you, thank well, you for Philip. <laughs> seven, nine. Wait, do you think six was afraid of seven? Because <gasps> seven, eight, nine. Oh my god! Oh, shit. oh my god! Seven was the killer the whole time. <laughs> killer seven. Oh, it's all coming together. Suit of 51? That burglar just now was trying to open it? I wonder what's inside this safe. Hmm. Is there any way we can figure out the last two numbers? Well, if it's only two, again. It, I bet it, with fingerprints we can. Ooh. Well, there's only, there's only 99 permutations. I just try it anyway. Fuck yeah. it. Well, we know the first two are seven and nine. Something that can help us figure out the last two numbers. Hmm. I wonder. Do we have a thing with numbers? That would be a bit too lucky, don't you think? Well, I suppose. If only there was something that could finger which buttons had been pressed. I, oh, you got to present the oh. the oh. fingerprint stuff. Oh, we're stupid. Okay. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They weren't yeah, looking yeah. for they weren't looking for something that would give us the number. Yeah. yeah. No, we, we, we we had already guessed that. It sounded like we had like said that once asking. before. Yes, then, yes. It definitely sounded like there was an item we had that yeah. would be like, "Oh, his favorite number was 7924." I've got just the thing. <laughs> well, I have an idea. I knew it, Apollo. What is it? Well, all we have to know is what buttons have been pressed. We can use this to find out what the next two numbers are. Uh, present. <laughs> Yelling at a safe is hilarious. Take that! <laughs> when you press the buttons, you'd have to touch them. With your finger, right? Or toes. Oh, maybe this person touched it with their feet. Kind of weird. Or they would licked that be? the buttons. Ew. It would leave a print. A butt print. <gasps> oh. When, oh, no, not me. when you open a safe, you don't press any other buttons than the right ones, right? So if we can find the buttons with fingerprints. I don't we'll think have so. The safe code. No, okay, yeah. You deserve you earned that one, Wes. Not oh, it's me. Not bad, Apollo. Thanks, me. <laughs> Not bad, Apollo. All right. Well, we do this in every single button. I was about to say, I want them all to be lit up. <gasps> oh. <gasps> Seven, nine, two, uh -huh. five. Look, you can you can see the oily finger residues clearly. They were eating hot Ew. flaming hot Cheetos. Oily. Wait, was Gant trying to unlock this? You can see the you can see the Cheeto dust everywhere. <laughs> Dang, can... these are some fun. These are those are some expired Cheetos that they left behind <laughs> white dust. It's Doritos cocaine flavor. Ooh, cocaine, cocaine for the kids. Cocaine. <laughs> Look at seven and nine. These are glove marks. 
The burglar must have been wearing gloves. Oh shit, it was Glover. It was Gant. Oh, yeah, it was <laughs> gotta Glover, love the right. glove. Gotta God, love the glove. You gotta love the glove. Well, we might not be able to identify the burglar, but we can open this safe. Let's give we it a can, shot. We can identify the friar. All right. Well, it's either it's either two five or five two. Which one do we want to guess first? I'm going five two all the way. Ah uh, shit! I'll, you know what? I gotta I gotta trust my boy Chris. All right, Chris. Oh, then it explodes and you die. Oh! Hey, oh baby! Got it, baby! It opened. Kitty! Oh, the golden cat of power. Oh, wow. That'll solve this whole case. You can't even yeah. look at this. Case. It's the case of the golden idol. <gasps> the fact that you can't click on the cat is a fucking crime. That's a crime. Like, he should at least be like, it's a golden cat. Like, mm. say, I don't know, say anything. This looks like a bullet hole. Hmm. You can still see the bullet sticking out of it. Trucy's like, uh-huh, uh-huh, I hear you, I see you, that's interesting, <laughs> but have you seen the cat? <laughs> Trucy's pocketing it? the cat. Yeah. What cat? Why is it in the what middle cat? of the safe? Exactly. <laughs> hey, the bullet came out. The tip is all squished. Good for the bullet. That takes a lot of courage. Yeah, you know, it does, yeah. Not, surpri <laughs> Not surprising, given that it was fired into a metal safe. This bullet's got a story behind it, that's for sure. <laughs> What a funny, funny way of story. Yeah. He starts talking to the bullet. <laughs> <laughs> What's your story, little guy? This city needs justice. <laughs> this looks like a medical shark. There's an x-ray in here with it. An x-ray? Hmm. I can't make heads or tails out of it. I'm not a fucking doctor. <laughs> and I can't read the chart either. It's all in medical speak. Medical ease. It's all in Italian. Why is it in Italian? <laughs> <laughs> you know, Maractus, it's a famous Italian name. Hey, of Italian mafia. Mafia. <laughs> oh, of course, because the mob, yeah. Mm -hmm. Full squircle. The names are easy enough to read. Look by patient. It says Waki Kataki. Where have we heard Where that, we name heard that name before? Damn it! <laughs> <laughs> Wait, hold on, hold on, shut up. Is his actual name Waki? Yes. Yeah. That is not a nickname. Yeah. His name no, is Waki. His name is Waki Kataki. Kataki. Yeah. Fuck off. Big wins. <laughs> come on, come on, you gotta learn your name. Mm -hmm. Is this Desi like Winfred? Yeah, it's Winfred. Yes. <laughs> Winfred Big Wins Kataki. Yeah. And you so, know, when he takes over the business, he's gonna be Waki Big Cock Kitaki. God damn it. Okay, you know, Wes, you brought me around. God damn it. <laughs> so, this is Waki, our client's chart, huh? Why would this one chart be here in this safe? Let's see. The physician's signature says Palmaractus. Where have we heard that name before? <laughs> eh? Do what? you know? <laughs> what is it, Apollo? Look here, where it says who filed the chart. Let's see. <gasps> oh. Nurse Alita Tiala. Son of a bitch. <laughs> She's the nurse. Nurse Eeny Miney. She's back in this one. Alita She's T not a battle angel. She's Wait. a battle devil. Alita T. Alita is Waki's fiance. Alita T. Alita. Alita T. Alita. Hey. Alita, Alita, Alita. Alita, Alita. <laughs> That's one to eat a too many, Apollo. -lo. That's awesome. <laughs> Apollo. -lo. Apollo. -lo. <laughs> When Apollo goes to uh, Applebee's, he orders a $1 margarita eat <laughs> <laughs> That's good. Never mind that. What's her name doing here? Live in La Vida, Apollo Loco. Nice. <laughs> oh. How should I know? Though... I guess it means she's on the staff at the clinic. 
Odd that she neglected to mention this before now. It's almost like she might have ulterior motives. Nah. Seems unlikely. <laughs> I'm sure she had her reasons. So Alita Tiala worked at the Maractus Clinic. And she had access to Walkie Kataki's medical chart. Wait, why did he spell it that way? What? What? <laughs> what? What is going on? Wait, wait. That's an incredible joke. How did you? How did you hear my spelling, Trucy? <laughs> you got the I and Y wrong, Apollo. <laughs> <laughs> this rule. This is really good comedy. <laughs> I'd be very interested to find out what this chart says. Who could help us decipher this? Who do we know that was formerly a doctor? Who now turned noodle salesman. Italian. And speaks Italian. Let's go see Javier. <laughs> All right. Do we know Are any down? birds? Yeah, Javier bird definitely help us out. God damn it. Whoa! What are those? What are those? <laughs> <laughs> this wall is covered with ugly sneakers. I mean, beakers. <laughs> and honeydew. <laughs> Eek. Something's me, me. moving inside that one. Oh, shit. It's the T-virus. <laughs> By God. The Maractus was... Uh, they're clones. He's making clones. <laughs> you, lo you look, Apollo. Uh, hey, look yourself. You can't... Oh. oh, it's a goldfish. The, the snack that smiles back? Until you bite their heads off. My god, he was turning <laughs> fish to gold. But no, it still smiles <laughs> back. It <laughs> just metal. smiles back from heaven. <laughs> I, I like to think all the goldfish I've eaten are smiling down at me. <laughs> yeah, they are. They smile also, back from heaven. Also, a lot of them. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> they, they'll come defend you in your time of need. All go, all snacks go to heaven. <laughs> wow, they're all fish. So many kinds. Except for sour patch kids, they go to hell. Yeah, Whoa. yeah, because yeah. uh -oh. they're not. I mean, for then sour and well, they're sweet. They basically well, do mean things and gaslight you. Yeah. They're going to hell, Zach. Well, <laughs> first they're sour and they're sweet. They're basically born with original sin, so they're going straight to hell. <laughs> unless, unless your sour patch kids have been baptized, they will go to hell. <laughs> Is there a sour patch Jesus now? <laughs> Yeah, it's the watermelon he, flavor. He, he died for your Sour Patch. Whoa, 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 whoa. Listen, we don't want to put any Sour Patch Bible spoilers out there, all right? <laughs> <laughs> listen, listen here, you Sour Patch bitch. <laughs> That's really good. Holy uh, shit. Whoever designed this had a sixth sense of humor. Sour Patch it. sin. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, Justin, well done. Oh, God. Die for your sour patch <laughs> sins. Wow, this is good. incredible. Uh, I'm going to look at this lamp on the floor. Look at this lamp. <laughs> kind of an expensive looking lamp, isn't it? It's ugly shit. Hey, the bulb's broken. Broken? Don't you mean burned out? No, our cat burglar must have dropped it. But why is it standing up on the floor like that then? Hey, look at the cord. Huh? There's a red splotch on the on a part of the cord. You think that's blood? There's a little that's it's a little bright for blood. Almost Pinkish. Oh no, did we get transported to a dang and rompa world? Is this video <laughs> game being written no. by Kodaka what? now? The code was Leon. Oh my god, that's why this case has so much to do with panties. It was written by Kodaka instead. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> Something's definitely odd about this lamp, that's for sure. Okay, and then probably the window. <laughs> the window is a jaw. Am I crazy? I thought the window was broken. Uh, I. It looks broken to me. Considering I mean, there, could be, there could be two windows. 
I guess. Yes. I, saying, the wind, I, don't know. I thought yeah, the I window know. was a window. I hate you. You're a shit. <laughs> the window is a the, the window's wow. a jar. That must be how our burglar escaped. I wonder who it was. Maybe it was just a burglar who happened to pick here. Yeah, but there's a patrol car sitting out front. If I were a burglar, I'd come back the next day at least. I'd give it a month myself. Whoever broke in obviously needed to break in today. Okay. I think that's everything here then. We we do have two more people to talk to now, so. Yeah, got a we lot gotta of things. go back and talk to both Emma and uh, Eldoon. And Palmrax is his grave. Oh, oh he's, he's not, not around, here? Dog game. Oh shit. Alright, let's go mansion. And then go. Where is everybody? <laughs> we were. Everyone was raptured while we were in the clinic. <laughs> <laughs> we're not going we to, sour to Sour Patch, patch Heaven. heaven. <laughs> <laughs> God damn it. Nice. God, we're funny sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> the big patch in the sky. <laughs> nice. I know that face. That's the face of someone who's made a discovery. Hey, how did you know? Yeah, did you know that sour? there's a Sour Patch Jesus? <laughs> and was like, what the fuck happened while you were in there? The church. We, <laughs> hello, we're from the Church of Latter-day Sour. Yeah, we, fa we found the morphine in the doctor's office. <laughs> you can't fool someone trained in the ways of science. Next she'll have us. Next she'll have us analyzing face prints. Bazoy. Take my face to your prince style. <laughs> we trained him wrong as a mistake or as a joke. <laughs> <laughs> Let's ask Detective Sky to help us, Apollo. My fingerprints look like milk duds. <laughs> <laughs> that's a lot of. That's a lot of prints. You go, you go this way. I'll go home. <laughs> uh, we want to show the shoes. That's a lot of prints. These sandals. They're mine. Where'd you find them? <gasps> He's like, those are really cute. <laughs> That's quite a clear print there. A toe print. Too bad we don't know whose toe it is. Oh, don't we? <laughs> well, there is a way of finding out, of course. What did she? Everybody, shoes off! Come on. <laughs> there is what? All you need is a sample of the same toe print off another shoe, for instance. Fuck! Where are we gonna find another shoe at a time like this? In this oh. economy? All right. So if the prints matched, you'd know the same person wore both. Hmm. I have another shoon worn by this. Yeah, it's got one right here. Come on. Got one right here. I think I just might actually. Really? I'm beginning to suspect something here. Uh, Detective Sky, can you compare this sample, uh, this sample with this other print? Should I hand her the panties? <laughs> no. I did say toe print sample, didn't I? Oh, fuck off. Where exactly is the toe print on this evidence? Oops, stormy skies ahead. Try again. <laughs> Scientifically this time, if you would. Hmm, a toe print, right? Okay, well, where the fuck? We might not have it. Do we need to, like, do oh. we need to, like, like examine it oh, and God, see if there's a toe print like on the inside? There it is. Oh, God damn it. it. They got us. Oh, wait, can we not do it? Oh wait! Oh, I should yeah, get it. Get, uh, zoom in. Yeah, twi twist, twist, twist your angle. You gotta be looking yeah. like. Oh, that is such a small yeah, spot. There, there we go. I wonder, could this be a print? Come on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. We know, we know it's a fucking yeah, analyze it. Come on. I don't like how close. I, I don't like how close Apollo got to those toe prints. He's <laughs> like. I'm so close, I can almost smell I it. hate you. I hate you. <laughs> He's like, well, I gotta make sure it's a toe print. <laughs> Nobody look! <laughs> <laughs> Chris, that was foul. I love that. <laughs> oh. I gotta take some of that horny gel heat for you, buddy. 
<laughs> so you're not, yeah. you're, you're not getting it all. <laughs> yeah, it's a big toe. <laughs> wow, I feel like the case is solved already. What was next? Well, we have to match the print, right? Right. Let's match it. Wait. Yeah, okay, we've already heard this. Well, yeah, yeah. Good point. Go we should talk to Emma Sky. It's almost like we're mid conversation <laughs> with look her. At her. Look, at, look at Emma while you're talking about her. <laughs> oh, she called uh -huh. me an expert, huh? You guys talking about toes over there? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, we, we don't need to present the slippers. We need to present the other ones. I think we do. No, no. Oh, okay. Ah, the slippers. That's quite a clear print there. A toe print. Oh, yeah. Too bad we I don't know whose toe stuff. it is. Oh, yeah, we read this. There's no. a way of finding out, of course. There is what? Oh, you oh did it? Sample of the same did it really what, skip what, us you? back? Well, I can't. Okay. All right. So oh, it's probably because you presented matched. a different piece yeah, of evidence yeah, yeah. to trigger this. I have another shoe worn by the same person. Got one right here. I got one yeah. right here. Dang, suspect something. Look at these shoes. What are those? <laughs> Look at these shoes. This pair of sandals, toe print and all. Oh, the print on these is nice and clear too. That makes our job easy. Can you analyze it for us? Of course. Hang on. Bingo. Gosh, I'm good. Bingo. How do you say that's a bingo? That's a bingo. <laughs> that, that's a bingo? You just hey. say bingo. Bingo. How far? How fun. <laughs> hey, One of my favorite bits he ever. We did. were the one who found the prince. A perfect match. The same person wore these sandals and slippers. I was afraid of that. All you have to do is find out who these sandals belong to. Or, do you already know? Well, we all oh, we can do some we can do some Cinderella shit. <laughs> I thought I thought Phoenix wore the sandals. So, is Phoenix moonlighting on with these sexy ass uh, wedge <laughs> wedges? Heels? Ooh, what would yeah. Phoenix's drag name be? Ooh. Honestly, just Phoenix, right? <laughs> <laughs> it, does, it does work as a drag name. <laughs> yeah, it does. I can't say. Not yet. Well, that's one big step closer. To the truth, I mean. <laughs> Alright, so we got that. Uh, let's see if Eldoon's back. Damn it. No. Just here to clarify, Phoenix Tight would be his drag name. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. <laughs> um. Uh, see if anybody's back here. No. What about oh, I bet. I bet we can ask uh, Walkie about these A shoes. Wacky about. About how his fiance is a dirty liar. His fiance has dirty toes. <laughs> hey, He's like, yeah, I know all about those like toes. It's my favorite thing. <laughs> I like to lick them. Jesus fucking Christ. I didn't say yeah. you got mad at him. Well, yeah, he talk, he's got a foot thing. <laughs> I mean, let's be honest. That's one of the more. That's like. It is one of the more, more common. I've actually more tame jokes than several ones Wes made last. Oh week. God. All right. <clears throat> nope, you can't go on the desk, you little shit. Well, the time of the decision is upon us. What well, decision? The time of decision is upon us. What are you talking about? Oh. Which one of our two jailbirds do we want to talk to? Oh. Excuse me. <laughs> Both detainees are currently in question and to corroborate their accounts. God damn it. Are you it. melting? Mr. Stickler and Walkie? Both of them? I pity the questioner. I pity the questioner. <laughs> yeah. Damn it. I guess we'll be back then. Okay, wasn't this one? Uh, maybe uh, Phoenix is you there. Go to That's the only place yeah. we haven't been. Okay, something's hey! here. 
I swear to God, if we do actually have to talk to Ari, if... I'm going to be so mad. <laughs> oh, thank God. <laughs> <laughs> uh, the prodigal attorney returns. Welcome, Apollo. I heard you did well in the trial today. Here to discuss something? I could use a little diversion. What did Detective Sky say? Uh, what did Detective Sky say? If you want to know something, you have to investigate it yourself. Mr. Wright! Tell me what happened seven years ago. Please. I want to know. I need to know. I want to know. Can Come you show me? me? <laughs> <clears throat> you certainly didn't waste any time getting to the point. Seven years ago. I want to know, did you commit perjury? <laughs> <laughs> Seven years ago, I was standing in a courtroom, on behalf of a client. The case involved the death of a certain magnificent genius. I'd be surprised if you hadn't heard about it. It was all over the news. I remember that. You were up against Prosecutor Gavin, weren't you? Yes. He was only 17 years old at the time. What?! <laughs> of, course, of course he was. 17 years old?! That's still in high school! He took the bar exam abroad, in Europe. They're progressive over there, you know. <laughs> yeah, right. That's, That's an incredible right. sentence. Yeah, Holy you know, shit. The, the legal drinking age is 16, and you can practice law when you're seven. <laughs> you can practice law as long as you have someone older watching over you. And you can practice <laughs> law while drunk. <laughs> <laughs> They're real progressive. <laughs> They're real progressive. Even Flo is a lawyer. They're real progressive, like the soup. <laughs> They're real progressive, like the car insurance. Is it car insurance? Yeah. Yeah. I well, it's just doing. all sorts. It's insurance, of period, mm, yeah. Gotcha. I was defeated by a 17-year-old newcomer. In my shame, I left the practice forever. Shame. That's all. That's all? <laughs> How could that be all? What do you mean? What about what they were saying on the news about right. forged evidence? Yeah. Dog bless you, Chris. Mm. They said you forged evidence and had your attorney's badge stripped from you. No, I forged an attorney's badge like that one guy <laughs> with the cardboard one. Who's Chris? Chris doesn't remember the name of. Oh, Vera Tigre. There Tell you. me, how does it feel? <laughs> how does it feel to stand here before Phoenix Wright, the forging attorney himself? <laughs> how does it feel? I don't want to believe it's true. But what about what happened in my first? But what about what happened in my first trial? That was actually a mistranslation. Yeah, he totally lied. <laughs> that was actually a mistranslation. He's the frogging attorney, not the forging. <laughs> Just like frog detective, it's frog attorney. Fuck yeah! <laughs> Didn't you notice in today's trial, there was a single piece of forged evidence? I'm talking about evidence that shouldn't have existed. A naughty magician's trick. Oh, he's a naughty magician. Naughty magician. <laughs> I don't see you jumping to my defense on this one. Maybe I did forge evidence. Maybe I didn't. It doesn't really matter Oh, I'll now, never tell. Does it? <laughs> You're going to have to wait until the fourth or fifth case of this game to find out the truth, Apollo. <laughs> but I'm not an attorney anymore. That's the only truth you need to know. Mr. Wright... Looks like he doesn't want to talk about the accusations of forgery. For now. Wow, cool. Uh, I don't really think we have anything to present to him, per se. No. These aren't your shoes, are they? Oh, shit. Okay, now I hope that... Eldoon's back. Son of a bitch! Uh, don't, don't even worry, don't even worry. You're racking your brain? Uh, thank you, thank you. Yeah, I'm racking my brain. You're racking oh, hey, your go brain. go back to the detention center now. I was gonna say, Damn we're it. Now I bet you they're free. <laughs> that makes sense. <laughs> uh, we were so close. Yeah! Whoa! Oh, 
Oh, I'm back. Oh, oh no. <laughs> Don't cry, Angel. Daddy's back, and Daddy's. Oh, you again. <laughs> Listen, I understand that the word daddy is pretty common in just everything nowadays. And a lot of people prefer being called daddy. I don't think Walkie can get is a daddy. No, not at all. <laughs> not even in the slightest. <laughs> Do you always have to announce your entrances like that? Man, my old man, he... Man! <laughs> he man! That's not Skeletor. God damn it. <clears throat> he man! N now I'm all in a funk! It it's his fault! One can only assume his father tried to teach him a lesson and failed, clearly. I want more big wins, man. I know! Bring him back. Uh, you two got your work cut out, cut out for you. Straight up, G! Of course, I don't care if they lock me up. I'm ready to go. Then why are you sweating right now? <laughs> That's just my sprite. Ignore that. <laughs> <laughs> Some days, I wonder why I do what I do. <laughs> hey, Apollo. <laughs> Same. That's not true, Flux. I love you all very much. <laughs> Please keep watching us. You fada. Hey, man, you won't see me bugging about one or two guilty charges. But what if you're found guilty of murder? Hey, it's all experience, you feel me, shorty? Like a badge of honor. Or a fake detector attorney's badge. <laughs> they 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 <laughs> they don't they don't give the death penalty, do they? <laughs> you didn't really do it, did you? Ellipses. Uh maybe I did, maybe I did! If I've learned one thing today. That silence speaks louder than words. Yafada. Yafada. Yafada's dead. Man, Tell me about my your old daddy. Man, my old man's whack. My daddy, he's whack. Disappointing. That's what daddy is. I hate it. <laughs> oh, no. I heard he wants to leave the mob. Over my dead body! Over my daddy body? <laughs> For my dead daddy, wait, what are we doing? Uh, <laughs> I, sp I spend my life trying to keep it real, being an OG, and never stepping down. Now my old man wants to go soft? Fine, let him. The rest of us will be hard and turgid. Just leave me out of it. Man, I love the use of the word turgid. It's never right. used, but when it is... <laughs> when it is, it hits you like a truck. Yeah. <sighs> The day I get out of the clink, that's the day Alita and I start the next generation of the Kentucky family. We gotta that's right. fuck We're so gonna hard. fuck immediately. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna keep myself turgid this whole time. I'm gonna keep gooning my entire sentence. <laughs> Welcome back to the turgid stream. Oh, I didn't. Save the game and suspend play? No. Oh, okay. Welcome back. Please don't Forget talk. It. Please don't talk as though it's assumed you're going to jail for my sake. Uh, present the shoes. The... No, you're actually going to present oh. his uh, papers. Well, hold on. The present card. the shoes. Yeah. I, he's got to say something about the shoes. Waki, you don't happen to recognize these, do you? Oh, let me see. God damn it. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, sure I do. <laughs> <laughs> I recognize that scent anywhere. I, I was the one who bought him for. I love the way it shows off her toes. I hate this. <laughs> for <laughs> Miss Tiala? Yeah, it was a birthday present. She's got mad. No, no, okay. It's not you. It's it's the video game now. Yeah, yeah. I, I'm I'm vindicated. Actually, this, he actually does have a foot fetish. This is confirmed. She's got mad little feet. Mad. They're furious. So cute, man. <laughs> so the sandals are hers. Yeah, I kind of had a feeling. What's up with the funky vibes and that funky smell? 
Sandals. Hey, updated. listen. I don't trust nobody unless I smell their feet. <laughs> I'm not going to put my feet up to the window. <laughs> <laughs> put it up to the little holes in the glass. This sucks. <laughs> <laughs> Man, that is so far off the hook, it's off the chain, G! I don't think you know what that expression means, Walkie. Yeah, he seems... Oh, uh, it's, not, it's not that one, it's a, a different thing. Oh. I wonder how Elite is doing. Go to the next page. Show him the bullet. Oh, I forgot we got this. Right, 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 right. Huh? What's that, some kind of Blu-ray? <laughs> God damn it. Wait. That That's right. Oh, that's you. That's right, Walkie! It's yours, and this is my line. <laughs> hey, look! I, I don't, I don't smoke or nothing. Uh, I'll, I'll live long, right? <laughs> and prosper. I mean, you got shot like last year, my guy. <laughs> I don't think he gets it, Apollo. Uh, take a closer look. Here, in particular, where it says "nurse," it's signed Alita Tiala. Huh? You lawyers do your homework, huh? Oh. So, you met Miss Tiala when you... Yeah, I met her at the clinic. So? Love is love, bitch. <laughs> Could you tell... So you also have a nurse fetish? God damn, my guy. <laughs> I get it coming and going. Most of the first part, though. Jesus Christ. Could you tell us a bit about the circumstances of your meeting? Fine, fine. I'll, I'll tell you how we met if you want to know that bad. Uh, also, the chat. Po several people in the chat pointed out that as Walkie said the line, "I don't smoke. I'm gonna live a long time." Chris immediately took a hit. <laughs> <laughs> About a half a year ago, I was shot during a little turf war with another family. No big deal. <laughs> I was ready to die, just like Biggie Smalls. Sure. <laughs> They came in and got me and hauled me off to the docks. Not like the, the water ones, like the doctor. <laughs> the Maractus Clinic? That's where I met a, my fallen battle angel. You mean Alita Tiala? She was scared of me at first, turns out. <laughs> but you know what they say, the bad guy always gets the ladies. What do you got? Right. She was done with that clinic anyhow. So I was like, I'll take, I'll take. <laughs> so I was like, I'll take you on, woman. What? Straight gangster style. Guess what she said? What did she say? I don't know. It was in Italian. <laughs> Come on, give it some thought. <laughs> they only speak Italian at the Maractus Clinic. <laughs> she said it real quiet, like on the down low. You know what I'm saying? I'll leave if you marry me. So, that was the proposal? You know it. An oath of love right there in the hospital room. Just like that, the op was done and we were out of there. See you later, Bazoyo. Um, about that op. Yeah, it didn't go so well after all, did it? I know about the report. I know it's still in me. That dog. <laughs> this health checkup was the boss's idea, you said. Yeah, can you imagine? What's the point of living healthy when you're a G? You know what I'm saying? What? This is a terrible outlook. You always <laughs> want to live healthy. What? Walkie, I, I get the impression you know about what about a third of the words you say mean. <laughs> <laughs> But didn't you learn about the bullet at that checkup? Yeah. That's why I knew that doctor had to pay. Figured I could get that cat pulled after I got my revenge. And hey, I'm still living large now, aren't I? Incidentally, had you ever had a health checkup before? Nah, my old man suddenly gets this idea that we all gotta get checkups. Guess he's getting old. Uh, older, I mean. What? 
Hey, he's getting all these questions about his health all of a sudden. Hey, no, no. Get out of but... here. Get out of here. Go to Eldoon. Okay, thank God. Okay, have fun with those shoes. <laughs> Do you mind, you know, we leaving won't. one with me? No. Just try really hard to stuff it through the glass. This sucks. <laughs>